fuck's good? It's your boy Mikey Pipes. We up in here at the Laundry Bar. One out's end of the world. The PX2 Grand Final. We got a crazy night of battles going on. We're into the second battle for the night. I'm not going to fuck around. We'll get straight to it. On my left, give it up for Rorschach and Flo. Yeah. Shoutouts to delicious Scots and Happy beverages. birthday to Snipes. Let's go. Huh? And their opponents, to my right, give it up for Fat Man and H. Dot Murray. Yeah. Fucking shout out to every cunt. Fucking one ounce especially. We've been smashing it. This cunt's a faggot. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, shout out to St. Albans. Rob too. All right? Every cunt down here. Yeah. Ready? They're going to get smashed. <laughs> All right, we already did the coin flip. H. Dot and Fat Man won. They've chosen for the homies to go first. Let's do it, boys. All right. Now, BK said I cheated on my missus. Well, that's certainly true. I never kept it a secret from her or from any of you. I'm sorry for abusing her trust. I'm trying to earn it all back, but it's a shame about ab battle raps about the dirt that you have. So it's a certainty that with that diversity spat, BK only beat me because he knew personal facts. And he said it was Flo who snitched. Well, that's whack, of course. So was BK talking trash or was it trash who talked? And I know this, the other dude who told him was Codex, but I don't blame him for swapping info about his buddy's opponents. So I won't hold a mad grudge or even judge it amped up because holding grudges over battle raps reserved for sad cunts. So I took two L's in a row. Time for me to switch the angles up. Put that shit together and you discovered the formula. See, Fat Man's religious and that gets my mercury rise and my temperament maddened. Cause they left you duped, it a shame that they believed that the earth was flattened. So these days you scoff down Mars bars to compensate for all the traumatic shit that happened while you were being raped in Uranus inside the confession booth that you sat in. Yeah. Whoa. Now you two, I don't know if I rate. You look homeless, mate. You're probably less than blow in weight. You're a bony, raking gayer than some roller skates. The only way you'll stab me is with your shoulder blades. <laughs> <laughs> and Pipe said it himself. You're Harley's hopeless mate. Only funny because you're on drugs and overweight. You go pop pills, smoke cones, get back, then comes on YouTube laughing at your dopey face. See? Me hey, hey, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> hey. You're Harley's sidekick. You try hard to rhyme hard and imitate his knife bars, but you'll always be the sideshow. You're just Harley's sidecar. See? See, naming yourself after yourself? Well, that's some fucking toy shit. Can't you're worse at coming up with original names than decoy is. And when you rap silent... <laughs> and when you rap silent as fuck against Codex, that shit was too awkward for laughter. Congratulations, can't you now have the only battle harder to hear than Manners vs. Disaster? <laughs> See? Alright, give it up for that round! First round on H. Dub Murray and Fat Man. Let's go. Fuck. You two little fucking faggots are gayer than driving boards. I'll jump on both your heads and bounce off like that shit was a diving board. <laughs> I just started. I'm the bad crisis lord. Bitches probably take one look at you two faggots and their eyes get sore. If you fucking talk big again, dickhead, I'll break your seismic jaw. Rorschach, your little slut wants me to keep her vagina warm. That shit's like a china store. She say, hurry up and buy. I'm like, slutty, won't you die? Then I pile drive that hole. <laughs> Fuckhead. When we found out it was you two dickheads, we're battling. Fat man's just like, get on. Mate, I'll shove four fingers up your mum too, twisted in the middle like I'm throwing up the western. And run out the fucking door in a blaze. Fire exit. Get up. You can call me a polygraph. <laughs> you can call me a polygraph the way I have these liars tested. Bars laced with cyanide. You might just die if I inject them, you lysy peasants. I'm murdering with words. How the fuck are the coppers gonna find the resident from this grime and check it? You'll get broken down into little bits like a deciphered letter. And Rorschach. What the actual fuck is a fat baron? Hey cunt, it's his missus, and she's a nice lady, and I cannot seem to leave her flaps alone. Every time I have to go, she grabs my belt, rips it out. No guns, but she, I let my big Mac explode. She said the speed was lethal, like an action show. And while this was all happening, Mazza was bashing Flo. <laughs> yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> Mazza was bashing Flo. What cunt, you wanna go? <laughs> this is how we do it. Muzzle was bashing Flo. Go. <laughs> I hope you two little fag faggots die. I wish as hell. Mate, you, compared to us two giants, you're fucking fairies. Tinkerbell. Where we're from, you'll probably get snuck up on like a splinter cell. No fucking cartoons when I'm Rocky and these Bullwinkles bells. Oh, yeah. Fuck you, fuck you, gun. And fucking, you gotta understand and face the fact. My blade that stashed will hit you flat in your chest like it's laser tag. 
Fucking me stacking up fucking death certificates from ba my battle kills is the only time you'll ever see my paper stack. And I'll fucking shred yours because you're just like a Jap car with crap parts, a piece of shit I couldn't wait to smash. <laughs> fucking I'll punch both your heads off later. <laughs> <laughs> See, fat man, if Harley promised that you that you were his first partner choice tonight, then those promises were empty. Because did you know that standing in your place tonight was supposed to be fucking stretchy? And if that, and you best believe if the she if she was available today, then he would have ditched you. I mean, shit, it wouldn't be the first time Harley wrote Stretchy's name for video views. Because if you didn't know, Harley and Stretchy is one out's most viewed battle. That's his whole claim to fame. So I'll call you a Dahlia Rose's mum the way you profiting off a skinny bitch's name. <laughs> So you're tall and lean and he's large, you see. Lee and Harley are both jokers, so it's Laurel and Hardy. But Lee just wants to be like Harley. Even the shivs you harbour are his, but you'll never be like Harley. Even your first name's only the second half of his. And if I caught either of you cunts trying to break into my house, you can bet there'd be a top brawl. I'll smash you in the fucking mouth with a padlock, cunt. Lockjaw. <laughs> see, you misses a slut. She couldn't possibly crave the cocks more. She's got tats on her badge telling in the cock she's had. Box score. <laughs> hey, your mum looks sour when I ask for sex. So I stuck it in her mouth before bed. <laughs> I had to fight that bitch until she gave me gobbies. Warhead. <laughs> and if she, if she asks me to return the favour, I'll lock myself in the toilet in the back room and pretend like I'm taking a shit. Shampoo. <laughs> See, the way Noongas are all drop kicks, well, it's something that I'm loving. I'll throw this fruity abo in a river, black currant. See, <laughs> see, your missus a slut. She's got sexual hysteria. She takes it in the ass, box, and mouth. She's a backstage pass. Access all areas. Hey, see anyone? See anyone can write those bars, dickhead. But Phil does that shit best, so stick to incest, you inbreds, because when you spit, I'm not impressed. See, the way you constantly ripping off Phil, that shit is whack. Even your fucking style is his too. I mean, shit, you want to be like Phil so bad? Should we have bought a fat kid for you to diss too? See, some of you may know that I beat Jay Ram at Amped Up, but the worst thing, to, the worst thing to happen to him that day still hadn't happened yet. See, Fat Man and Harley both stayed over at his house right after the event. And through the course of this battle, if I still haven't convinced you that they're both fucking dogs yet, then J-Ram, you should know that when you had your back turned in your own home, that these two were hitting your missus up ahead. Whoa! See, and J-Ram loves Batman, so that's a relevant factor. Because the way you two stabbed him in the back, I'll call you both Bane when he tried to play chiropractor. And Fat Man, that massive status you made about respecting women, I fucking laughed when I viewed it. Because respect for me, well it's at that point that you'd lose it. Because after Amped Up, you were hitting three girls in attendance up to suck your dick at the hotel. I've got the chat logs to prove it. So stop saying you want to be respectful to women and just actually fucking do it. Yeah. Give it up for that round! Yeah. Second round of the homies! Let's do it boys. And who's copying who, fuckhead? You'll get smacked in Hurst. You gotta understand something. Between me and Phil, I fucking battle first. <laughs> yeah, can Rory Keeble, when your mum shat you out into the doctor's hands, he dropped you on the floor all feeble. That shit's what I call a poor retrieval. Why you here? You give fuck shouldn't you be out stalking people? I've got a darker force that's evil. And I got your slut. So wet last night, it was worse than 40 Cedus. And I heard you threw up before your battle. It's true, but. Colby's got no balls at all. It's about to get heated like I threw you into the sauna shackled. And in this league, he's gonna get nowhere. And if he's doing, it might take a while like when a Mormon travels. So Flo, stop riding Rorschach's dick like a horse and saddle or use my force and tackle and put you in all sorts of grapples. And then the thought of battle makes me resort to leaving yeah. your fucking body all over the fucking floor like a war torn soldier's corpse on the gravel. Oh. <laughs> yeah. You fucking maggot. Your slut's badge, I'll break in Enna, and I ain't even talking about a robbery. Once I get going, no clown's gonna be stopping me. I'll blindfold your slut and have a bunch of my boys' balls jump around in her mouth like the shit was a lottery. <laughs> <laughs> and fuckheads, you wouldn't even be able to hit me in the face if you tried. But rib shots, whoa! Those land, I'll stick these pricks. No grams. Rorschach, I bet you fucking act hard here and go and see your missus and slow dance to some music about romance. And for that, when you're hanging around us big dogs, don't ever try and be Kevin Hart and act like a grown man. Because you get smashed. Because you've got to understand something. 
Your fucking bars are small, contained in vials. Mine's a drop bomb, evil you can't keep up with. Chop quads for my mind, the training's vile. I'll turn all fuck battlers to a bag of bones, stack them up, no graphing, but they got tagged up toes, and I'll inflame the pile. And you're just in the way, you little child. And fucking I'll slash your face. <laughs> you know what, cunt? And Maces, I rorted ya. And you know what I bought, cunt? I went to Macca's. I didn't get a quarter, a pound is what I ordered. And that's something to know. I stole a floor shack, but no movies. Next I'll be hustling flow. We in the jungle, oh, he's gonna rumble, let's go. This ain't no fun, you think I'm dumb? So you said some shit about church? I'll blast your minds. Him in the past, going to the church of beauty in the pastor's eyes. Fucking done working duties and he asked for pay, it done master disguise, sorry to say flow. But it must have went past your rides because his little fucking task of life will come with a glass of wine. That priest's a fucking bastard guy, because that shit was 100% past your eyes. And you cut you. I call your missus Willy Wonka. She's got silly knockers. When, <laughs> when she gives gods, they're never ending. Nothing can really stop her. So the secret's out. The ho was screaming loud. She gave the recipe around. Everybody heard her sound just like a fucking party popper. <laughs> Alright, time, give it up for that round! Yeah. Yeah. Alright, last time you two fucked, that man had a heart attack and Harley broke a rib. <laughs> Your mum, the lonely bitch, complains to me about having to raise such a dopey prick. So while you all been in St. Albans, I've been with that junkie bitch, she wanted to shoot some shit up. She's like Sasha Gray, the way she likes to take two pricks at once. <laughs> I was fingering her box but went outside the lines like a shit parker. Slipped my finger in her ass and made her wetter than a big harbour. So I stuck my fist in, she said, can you go a bit harder? I was up to my elbow in her rim, you can call me Vince Carter. You want to know how I know that you're a chroma from afar? He gets upset about petrol prices rising. Doesn't own a car. You want to know how I know that your Aboriginal heritage needs to do better, man? When your tribe's sacred ground is actually liquor land? <laughs> <laughs> you want to know how I know that your life is bound to end in failure when you're repping the west side in Australia? <laughs> no, you pair of absolute sprogs. You probably smoke crack pipes from Pipes Crack. If I was to put a muscle in a mad fight, I wouldn't ask you two for an ice pack. You see, we run off food and water, got blood flowing through our ventricles. You fucking run on ice like Frozone from The Incredibles. And why is it that you rap like a dumb cunt? Woo, like to take some drugs, fix you, woo, put it in your mum's cunt. I'll get my fist and put knuckles to face and leave you marked by digits like a car's number plates. And seeing as in my last battle, I copped some unexpected shit, I thought, why don't we dish some out as well and just be disrespectful pricks. From Fat Man to Essence, November 7th. Hey, baby. <laughs> Personals too. How was your long weekend, princess? <laughs> There's more. Honestly, sitting behind this computer just makes me want you more. Like, like straight out, I sit here and all we can do is talk until the next event, basically. You ask these questions and it makes me shy. <laughs> and I'm not sure, just seeing that I can't have you right now makes me want you more. But you're not just a thing. But you're not just a thing. You're a beautiful, attractive girl, which makes it ten times worse. <laughs> Be the one hugging you. Oh. Kiss hug, kiss hug. <laughs> Where did that rhyme? You mad right now? <laughs> you want to fuck Essence so bad right now? <laughs> Yo, so make jokes like your missus fucking dumped her, dumped you with a battle crowd around you. But the fact that she was willing to show me that a month before we battled here proves that she doesn't, doesn't give, give a, a fuck, fuck about, about you. <laughs> Stop making fucking abo jokes, you abo jokes, you racist dog, before I fucking treat your heads like fucking Rorschach's Mrs. Undies and take them off. Hey, cut. What you just spat before just fucking proves that you wanna whack the whore. You fucking shit cut, why are you jealous of me? Because I've got the fucking smooth moves and that's a fucking one of my flaws. Cop that, cut. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Flo! 
Listen, fuckhead, if you ever talk again in a cocky way, machete or a blade, you can let the fucking options weigh. Fucking Ambos will rock up, treat him like he's a fat cunt, look at his face and be like, damn, that's not in shape. And that's all because I put the fucking beat to his head like I'm Dr. Dre. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Thanks, Doc. Fucking faggot. <laughs> and you obviously boss him around on some pet shit. <laughs> you probably let him. Fucking faggot, you stick your dick in, in his ass on a flop and then get stiff. I will fucking have your blood dripping like a wet fish. Fat man knows who I'm knocking out next, bitch. Go on, guess which. Both of you fucking pretend gimps. Dead end quick. You fucking Rorschach, your missus had a hot ass pussy before I got in there. Desert Strip. Wait, I have to interrupt you again. Then I got in that bitch's pussy. That shit was old and tattered. Like a cricket pitch. That shit was bold and battered. <laughs> Done, treated her like drugs, you know we were sold and scattered. Then trolling faggots with fucking revolting damage. Then I'm convulsing like assaulting grannies. Then I'm insulting zannies. It leaves you resulting in panic. And I hope you fucking both die like fucking dissolving and disintegrating in acid. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mate. With my murderous ways, I'll put these nerds in a daze. I'm fat man, so of course they're getting served on a plate. I know my way around the ice, I put a Sherpa to shame. This shit's like turf in your veins, they're guaranteed to be hurt in your brains. And then, I'll eat that pounder. Oh, fuck that pounder, mate. That I fucking... Yeah? Let it build up. You better have a fucking shield, cunt. Cause I'm gonna take a violent fucking dump on your face. There's your happy meal, bruv. Yeah. Hey, fucking shut up and stop calling time or I'll punch you in the mouth. I will fucking beat you in one bar. I fuck both your mums in a, on their periods in a spa. Blood bar. <laughs> if you ever fucking jump in another photo with us in it and throw up a love heart, like a fucking car crash without a seatbelt, I'll rip you out your fucking mum's car, punch hard, and your fucking head will be swollen up bigger than Professor Clump's ass. <laughs> you are a bunny of a dog. Flat out. That's it. Alright, give it up for that motherfucking yeah. man. We both can test me What do you guys think of that battle, yeah? Oh, yeah. 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 yeah! You know what's up? We're gonna get the results straight in. Before we do, I gotta give a big shout out to my sponsors, LMG Studios for all the tech support. Couldn't do this without you guys. Gotta give shout outs to OzHipUpShot.com, Subtle Designs, Battle Gear for hooking up with the gears. Um, that's about it, man. Of course, my boy Ollie at Southside Custom Inc. Writing off people's necks and shit like that. All right, guys, we got the result in. I want you to make a lot of noise for the winners. Rorschach and Flo, give it up. Yeah. End of the world, cunt. Fucking uh, Harley and Batman versus Rorschach and Flo. Uh, yeah, it was alright. I, I gave it to Batman and fucking Harley. Their last two rounds were just a lot. I don't know, they just flowed better, fucking sounded better, better multis, better punch, more relevant shit. Fucking, yeah, I'll give it to fuck, Batman Harley. What's well, good, addict, end of the world? I actually disagreed. I went with uh, Flo and Rorschach. I thought it wasn't what Flo said about the essence thing. That, that didn't really affect my decision because I didn't really take that into consideration much. It was just more the bars and there was a couple stumbles on the other side. I think there were still too many like misses, jokes and shit like that. I want to try and see battlers try and get away from that, start using original angles. But they were both like quality, quality, quality. A lot of one bar setups and shit. But overall I'm going to have to say Rorschach flow. Peace. What up? Barry Bonza. Uh, we're here at the PX2 final. Just watched Harley, Fat Man versus Rorschach and Flo. Uh, it was a cool two on two, man. Um, they both have good energy, work together well as teams. Um, I thought first round was pretty square, both had stumbles. Uh, second round, I thought Flo and Rorschach did well to kind of pick apart the boys' styles a bit with the, you know, the, the Drake punchline, like the freeze punchline thing. I thought they did well with that and they kind of picked apart the styles when they did that later, it had a bit less effect, even though it's funny as fuck. Um, and the third, I think uh, Flo and Rorschach just edged that as well. Just they had slightly more momentum. And uh, I agree with that. I, I think that the the message stuff was kind of a bit played, but it, it did the damage. It was the biggest reaction of the battle. So two nil, Rorschach flow.